Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? I hope you guys are having a good day. I want to hop on real quick. And if you're catching this live, type live in the comments. If you're catching this on replay, type replay so I can thank you later. I want to talk about daring to be different. And okay, well, Sasha just made her appearance on Facebook. Um, but I want to comment if you have cats that love to lay on your computer because that's how Sasha is. But um, anyway. <laughs> My inspiration for this video is coming from this. This is a lemon. It is by far my favorite fruit ever. Um, I put them in everything. Put them in my lemon. Um, we cook with them. Sometimes I just eat them. Yes, that's something I really do. I know it's terrible for your teeth, but I can't help it. But I just, oh my gosh, get out of here. Do you guys see this cat? She's ridiculous. Seriously. <laughs> So I just want to talk about um, daring to be different and sometimes I feel like life can be just like a lemon. It can be sour at times, it can be bitter at times, it can be rough like the outside of a lemon at times. And you know there's that old age old saying, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. And I really started thinking about it and I started thinking about how I view the negative things that happen in my life or the bad things that happen in my life. Um, you know like little things like getting a splinter in my foot to the bigger things like unexpected bills or um you know maybe a loss of some kind or like you know a family member or um you know losing your job or maybe not getting the grade you wanted just all of the negative things that aren't necessarily something you caused maybe somebody else caused them maybe it's just the universe uh, maybe it's just life and all of those things that get thrown at us that we can consider lemons because they're bad, they're sour, they're bitter, you know, they leave a bitter taste in our mouth, they make us feel bad. Put it to in the comments if you experience something like that, if you know what I'm talking about, something that just seems like a lemon, it seems sour, it seems like there's nothing good that can come from it. Um, you know, we have those things, they're inevitable in life. And I was just thinking about how I view lemons so much differently than other people probably view lemons. I love the sourness. I love the bitterness. I eat the entire lemon. I eat the rind and everything. And I actually put salt on my lemon. You can put a three in the comments if you think I'm crazy. But um, I just really enjoy them. And I got to thinking about what if we change the way we viewed the lemons that are thrown in our life. What if we thought about all the things that lemons make? So we know that they make lemonade, um, which tastes really good. We know that they make marmalade. They actually use the entire lemon for marmalade. Um, there's lemon meringue pie, lemon bars, colada, lemon tart, lemon pudding, lemon sherbet, lemon curd. There's actually something called Sussex Pond pudding, which is like a lemon pudding. So when you think about all of those things, um, some of those I've never heard of, but drop something in the comments that you maybe make with lemons or your favorite lemon recipe. I promise I'll try it and I'll put it on here and I'll give you kudos. But think about all the things that people make lemons with. Um, they're all yummy treats. Even your alcoholic beverages sometimes have lemon in them. And when you're eating that lemon pie or that lemon bar or that lemon pudding or you're drinking that sweet, refreshing lemonade, you don't think about this ingredient, which is most of the time considered sour and bitter and I've been told disgusting, gross. <laughs> you don't think about that. You know, you think about the deliciousness. So why is it that lemons get such a bad rep? Um, you know, is it because we focus on the bad things of this lemon as a whole, not, oh my gosh, this cat. We don't focus on, you know, um, the other ingredients. What if we stopped focusing on the lemons that life throws at us? What if we start to look at a lemon differently? What if we looked at the whole recipe rather than just this one ingredient? What if when life throws you know, those bad things like the unexpected bill or it throws the, you know, job loss at us. What if we stepped back out of our 
initial feelings about that sour, bitter thing that happened in our life? And what if we looked at the whole greater picture? How would it change us as a person? Do you think it would make us less sour and less bitter? You know, you get a, an unexpected bill. Yeah, it sucks. Put a four in the comments if you've gotten a bill that you either didn't know about or you forgot about, or maybe um, you know you thought it was being handled one way or another and it wasn't. Like, yeah, that's it's bitter, it's sour, it stinks. I mean, you have to pay for it, you have to find the money for it. But what if you stepped back and you took the sour lemon out and you thought about it, the whole picture, the lemonade, and you thought, hey, I wasn't sent to collections over this. That's a big deal and that's super sweet. It's super refreshing. It could even be considered delicious, okay? What if you get fired from a job and you step back and it's not great, but five years down the road, five weeks maybe, imagine what life could be like if you focus on the positive and the deliciousness that you could potentially get. So, when I say dare to be different, when life throws you a lemon, stop thinking about the sourness, stop thinking about the bitterness, throw a little bit of salt on there, take a bite out of it. Think about the whole ingredients, not just this one sour lemon, and see if it does anything to change your day, your, your week. Just give it a shot. It might be better than you think.